Welcome to the Pathi demonstration of women's safety device by using Raspberry Pi 4 model we are using. So the main features of this project is whenever uh, the person does uh, wear this device in a panic situation, then uh, she press, she need to press the switch. So when she press the switch, then the system will get the location values with the help of this GPS and it will capture the photo of this front scenario in front of this camera and uh, the location along with the photo will be mailed to the registered email id then after it will send the message alert to the registered phone number by using this gsm module so all these operations will be done with the help of this pi4 uh, model and we have interfaced the pi camera and a gsm module and a gps module along with uh, switches the, these switches are used to on the flashlight as well as, as the buzzer so all these input and output modules are interfaced to this pi4 model coming to the interfacing connections gsm interfaced at the pin number 14 pin number 15 for this gps module pin number 2 for the uh, flashlight this is just a lead indication which will indicate the heartbeat of this kit when it is continuously blinking that is indication of it is uh, execution of the steps and the third pin is interfaced to this panic switch so these are the main interfacing to this uh, pi4 and coming to the components so we are providing power supply uh, from this lithium ion batteries so we are using two lithium ion batteries which are connected in series so we'll get 7.4 volts but the operating voltage of our component is 5 volt so we need to regulate that 7.4 volts to 5 volts with the help of this lm2596 voltage regulator so after this we'll get the 5 volts so that 5 volts is input to the whole circuitry through this switch so when we switch on that the whole system will getting on and uh, the raspberry pi will take 20 to 30 seconds of duration to boot in the operating system uh, which is loaded inside this memory card so we have coded the uh, so called uh, instructions inside this memory card using python language and uh, which will execute step by step once the operating system boot in successfully the first step is this led will on and off two times then after it will initialize a setup connection between the gps and gsm module then uh, the lights will on and off for every two to three seconds duration that is indication of one loop was successfully executed so when a person is panic situation she has to press and hold the switch at least of 1.5 second then this light continuously on now the system is sending sms first then send the email and this is a continuous process till we switch off the power supply to the switch uh, system let us see the demonstration so that and also one more uh, extra feature we can add in the future the taser this is a taser to provide the shocking so for that purpose just we need to connect the b at this b slot here only one pin and this next two pin at this a slot so when uh, the person presses the switch automatically uh, mail sms and the third step is the taser will be activated so this is a feature scope we can add the uh, that to the system now go to hotspot settings of your phone and on the hotspot with project without any space without any capital letter password should be one two three four five six seven eight nine ap band should be 2.4 gigahertz these three steps are very important after enabling the hotspots and data we can see the one device is connected sorry zero device connected initially so after enable the hotspot and data just you can sorry and the next step is first step is on the hotspot and the data the given credentials next step is insert a valid sim card into this gsm module like this uh, you can use uh, atl or uh, uh, vi or bsnl other than uh, what of uh, sorry geo the geo won't work in this gsm module so insert that properly then after these two steps successfully uh, completed on the power supply to the cage so you can we can see this light blinks uh, and before that then we can see network led green light so which is blinks fast once the system got the signal to the sim card now the blinking light is slowed down that is indication of sim card got the signal otherwise check the sim card insertion properly and if the sim card inserted properly and the sim card is not getting the signal then check with the battery power right now the led is blinking and after that it blinks now the heartbeat of this system so when we are in emergency the she has in emergency then she has to press and hold the switch before that let me show you the flashlights so the flashlight purpose and the panic buzzer indication when she is in need of help panic indication 
and when uh, she is in need of help then press and hold this switch so one second is enough the light got switched on and wait uh, till the new message will be arrived into this mobile phone right so we got the email uh, sorry message and we can see that uh, here we are showing the 00, zero as we are demonstrating the project so we got the mail also so as we are demonstrating the project under the roof there is no sky vision for the gps module that's why it is getting the zero zero values so once we place the kit under the roof it will get the live location and that will be indicated on this led so we can see there is a small led which will blinks that is indication of the gps got the live location so let us see the images right so this is the image we are getting from the raspberry pi this is a continuous process Till we switch off the power supply to this cage. Right. And finally, to recharge this battery, just unplug this gently. Remember, this side is negative, spring side, this side one, and this is going to be the positive. We can see the uh, like polarities on the battery also. This is the negative and this is the positive. This is the positive side. So please insert the same manner. So negative this side and positive this side we can see the red uh, green light indication and after inserting that into the 230 volt socket we can see the red light indication which is showing the status of battery charging on battery completion fully charged then this will turn into the green again you can remove that from here like that keep the batteries under full charge both batteries and while inserting take care of the polarities right check double before inserting the battery into the charging slots or a kit slots right Thank you.